Hey there, everybody. Fett here, and welcome back to Fett Plays Monster Sanctuary. You know, we've explored most of the Blue Cave. I think we need to explore more over here, though, in the snowy peaks. This is where the water is, but we have the raw hide for the what's her face. There we go. For the clothes maker. So I think we should try to make that happen. All right, we need to use water or... Oh yeah, that's right. Sean should be great here, actually. Yeah, Sean should be perfect for this. And then we just use, like, Northern Sean. Maybe Vector for a little bit of extra whoop butt. See how that works out. Okay. Give me your power. Make it overwhelming. Give us the ability to make that slap. I was hoping for a little bit more, but okay. Uh, you know, we should probably go ahead and use a fiery storm to start off with. Does count as three hits, and we got two burns. It was about exactly what we were hoping for. Icy Bolt, we might get the kill here. Oh, baby! That was the money. Here comes the gemstone rain. It hurts. But it's a, it's a pain we can deal with. Oh, no. We've been chilled out. No problem. No problem at all. We're gonna slap down a feather storm here. Alright, alright. Not bad, not bad. Give me another... Yeah, another firestorm. Should get the kill. There it is. And we got a burn. And then we just finish it off with an ice bolt. Waboom! Easy rares. Give me a slug. Hey, he's done it. He has not gotten the egg. Damn. Well, you can't say we didn't try. All right, moving up. Got to climb all the way up to the top of the mountain to find the clothes maker. Also got to find out where we can get some of those earth gems. It's a, that's what I assume those are. Wait, we never went this way? Following areas aren't implemented yet in the current version of the game. Oh, okay. I found Spoilerville, boys. That's all right. Oh, hey, it's you. Yeah, let's give her to you. And by that, I mean catch you. You guys look awesome. Little gold tails here. Uh, they're weak against physical. They're strong against magical. Should be easy enough. Just don't use Mr. Karate. Definitely use Dwayne. And they don't have fire attacks, so Dwayne is going to be perfect here. Uh, they do use air and leap, so... Yeah, Gaben and Vector could be in trouble here. You know what? Vector and Sean, I still think this is a good combo. Watch it. Uh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. I think we got something here, boys. Check it. There's the power. Alright, we're gonna try a snowball toss. Sock it to him! Oh, he didn't get the kill. That's okay. Shielding. Get the shield, get the beat down. Get them feel good vibes. Hit me. Ow. Hit me. You use whirlwind on the wrong dude. All right. Feather storm. Slap, bap, bibbity, bap. All right. And then another snowball. Give me the crit. Come on, Sean. He's not done it. Uh, he tried, though. I could guarantee the kill. That seems like the better move, all things considered. Let's just do it. And that shield is absolutely wicked. Undeniably. Roll in level three. Ain't no thing. Give me a sidekick. Why? Because I want the total buff. And then I want the feathery storms. And then I want the guaranteed kill. Give me all of your shields. And then that treasure chest you're hiding. I see it back there. Don't think I didn't. He's done it again. Yo, dang. We cannot get an egg for some reason. Ah, we need to get a level up, though. Mr. Karate. I'm getting a little bit stronger. He's got that double impact down already. Hmm. We get more mana. We should probably... We should probably go ahead and get Explosion. 
It is a physical attack, so it does give him a little bit more variety in how he can womp. And we could always up his physical even more. So let's we'll see how it works. A mass antidote. Hmm. All right. I can't complain about that. That's all that was over there. Why did we not go over there for so long? How the heck are you supposed to do this? I don't understand. <gasps> Sean! He's done it, you little mango man! Oh! <laughs> okay. Lesson learned. Okay, gotcha. Oh, that makes me feel so dumb. Hey, crit chains and mana. Sweet. All right. Let's go. What do you got? Weak against fire. Two of them weak against fire. One of them weak against water. All right. Sean, Mr. K, and then Gaben. Gaben for his big old D. He's got the biggest D. Check it out. Gave us all some D. Okay. I mean, the snowball toss isn't that strong. So let's start with a sidekick. There we go. Now we can move on to massive damage. Fiery ball storm. With some real crits in there. Oh, you stinky cat. Oh, no. Okay. Not too bad. Kind of bad. Dang it. They still got through. The jerk. Can you get a kill? You cannot. Dang it. All right, give me a spell shield. There we go. Now slap me up with that snowball toss. Wa-bam. We did get the armor break, which is nice. I was really hoping... You know, give me the poison cloud. Give me some dot. There it is. Got it on two of them. Got a kill on one of them. Beautiful. Riot means higher crit chance. We gotta get rid of the cat. Ooh. I didn't like that. That hurt. <laughs> Alright. Give me the fiery punches. Come on, Gaben. Decent damage. Firestorm should get rid of the other Mogwai. Hey, he has done it again. Okay. And then one major slapper. Give me that crit. Bam! Aw, oh, nards. Oh, he's just healing. Alrighty then. Womp! Now, of course, he gets the crit. Whatever. Whatever, we still got, like, a bronze. Nothing to complain about. I would love some more, you know, monster eggs, if you'd be so kind. Do me this favorite. Favor. Uh, Vector, please make up for my poor platforming skills. No, no, no. Oh, ooh, I can, I can do my second jump off of his flight. Ho, 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 ho. He really does make up for my subpar platforming skills. What a nice burb. All right. Give me. All right, we need physical. So that's Dwayne. We need water or air. So that would be basically you guys. All right. Start me off with power. Overwhelming, if possible. And then give me a sidekick. And then give me the shield. Come on, Dwayne, give me some crits. Heck yeah! Ooh, Dwayne Rocky Johnson. He's an actual champion. I hate Protect so much. All right, nothing to worry about there. Not a thing. Feather Storm. Ooh, you actual jerk. You know what? We got a lot of good stuff out of that still. So I think what we do is shielding leaves again. Give me that double shield. Oh, <laughs> Rocky. Oh, Rocky's so good. And then Ice Bolt. If it's a crit, we might get the kill. Oh. Oh, God, that was good. Oh, God, that was good to communicate. Hey, he's we got them both. Sweet. All right. Yo! 
Arm Tail, and Crystal Snail. So good. Heck yeah. Look at that. I love the tongue action that he has going on. It's so good. He's so good. I'm gonna go ahead and give it one name here. Australium. I love him. I love him already. All right, Crystal Snail. I mean, he that is what he is. He is a Crystal Snail. Mm-hmm. All right. We will call you Gary. Let's go, Gary. All right. I gotta see what you guys can do. Okay. Gemstone Rain. It's magical damage. He has a magical advantage to his, to his attacks. Wind and Earth. Gold Sense. Increases gold gain after combat by 10%, as long as he's a participating words in combat interesting magic plus magic 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 soul beam applies regen to himself oh, neat whirlwind gale it's all enemies more gold sense the gold sense is pretty neat as far as concepts go I like it uh, go ahead and give me gemstone rain and give me that soul beam whirlwind 2 uh, yeah, let's go gold sense, please. All the way down. All the gold sense. Defense proc? Yes. Overcast. Increases the mana cost of all attacks by 10% and damage by 15. So he can hit hard. He can hit like a truck. Dude, Soul Beam itself is just heckin' strong. What, what kind of attack is that? Earth? Okay. It's a magical earth attack. Gotcha. Yo, double impact. Yes. Chance at uh, exploiting another hit. Give him more mana. Give him Whirlwind. Okay. I feel like Australium could hit really hard. Gary, what do you got? Gemstone Rain. Protect. Redirects the next attack on target ally to this month. Oh, it's an on-purpose guard. Okay. That gives him a shield. That makes so much sense now. Channel. Tackle. Okay. He's got good magic. And obviously he's got like, he's got shield out the wazoo. Uh, let's see what else can he learn. Gemstone Rain, Jewel Blast. All right, lots of damage. I like that. Actually, it's like 100% better than Gemstone Rain because extra critical damage. Oh, but Gemstone Rain hits a lot of time, so it's good for combo. I got you. And it works with Cascade. I I'm picking up what you're putting down here. Full defense, pretty neat. Reflect mana generator. Regenerate four mana for every hit this monster receives. That's a weird one. When getting attacked, reflect 25% of damage back to the attacker. Reflected damage is not affected by any modifiers. Ooh. Okay. Toxic slam. Physical damage does a debuff. Okay. So this is interesting. So we can get channel, shield cast, and then reflect. Now he can hit attacks back. There's a chance to chill enemies when he hits back, attacks back. Okay. And then he gains mana for it. He can shield himself and allies. Preemptive shield. Yes. Give him 50% of his, his defense of the whole party. He's got great shields. Give him jewel blast as well. Give him cascade. Yeah, there's a lot he could do there. Okay, let's... First of all, let's look at him in the Monster Journal again. Uh, there he is. Curious mix of reptilian and canine physiology. Cool. Its primary diet consists of mana, which it obtains from specific minerals found in caves and underground. Still loving that tongue. Uh, let's see. There he is. The most well-known resident of the crystal caves of Snowy Peaks. In fact, they are the source of the brilliant crystals found in those caves. Nifty. All right. I... So here's my problem. I don't really want to swap anyone out. I love all of you, but I think I'm going to go with Sean. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and unequip Sean. It's not to say I don't like him. Sean's great. Sean is a lovely dude. But I want to try out Australium. Let's give him... He needs magic. So, staff... Extra crit chance is nice. Uh, let's see. Is there anything that just boosts magic? No. Okay. Fang. 
give him that. Yeah, there they go. Wizard hat. And then... Let's go with... Is there anything else that boosts magic? No, okay. Okay, then give me that crit chance with the bandana. Cool. Party. Uh, Rick. You know what? Gaben, you've been a loyal contributor. You don't have much attack power, though. I want to see if I can get more. And actually, now that I think about it, uh, unequip. We should unequip everyone who's not in any kind of battle. If he's not in, if they're not in a battle position, I should say, we should unequip them. Okay, Gary, we need you to have magic as well, actually. So we'll go ahead and give you the Cestus, and it boosts your defense, which is perfect. Scroll boost magic as well as Man of Regen. No, I want it. Yes. Oh, 52% damage reduction. Ribbon gives some health and mana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mana regen. Mana and healing skills increase. That doesn't help us. Hmm. Thinking that helmet might be where we go. Looking around. I'm still thinking that's where we go. Defensive crit damage. Yeah, get the helmet. Oh, no, not the helmet. The diadem is actually even better. Yeah. Okay, not much on the way of attack power. But do it the ZF defense. Now, give me a battle. I want to test this out. Hmm. What is this? Oh, no. I've been up there. That's a chest, right? Yep, that is, that is probably a chest. Okay, don't worry about that. We gotta find a lady. And yes, Thor is outside right now. Don't worry. He'll be okay. At least in theory. Uh. Okay, they, gotta, they use water. Gary's weak against water. But they... No, wait. They use physical attacks. Leaf and wind. It's not the first time I've gotten those wrong. Problem is, two of them use physical attacks, and... Australium is weak against physical attacks. But let's try it anyway. Alright, let's start... Channel and Spell Shield. Spell Shield is not that useful. Let's use Protect. Protect Australium. Holy jeez! Okay! That was good. Okay, Australium doesn't have a single attack that helps us out here. That is probably a mistake. Yeah, that was probably a big whoops on my part, but he can give himself regen, so let's do that. Soul Beam! Ooh, wow, and he has the crits, too. Dang. Speaking of which, the enemy's gonna have the crits here. This is gonna be a really long fight, I feel like. Cool, he got all of his mana back, too. Okay, now... I guess we go with Jewel Black. No, we go with Gemstone Rain. It has more hits to it. Yeah, this fight's gonna take forever. Whir oh, Whirlwind is good here. Yes. All right, I think now we go with Ignite. Even though we could do some good damage with the Claws or the Stone Rain. No, I think we go with the Claws. Yeah, Claws was the right move. Okay, they're probably going to both spend turns healing now. Both the cats. Yep. Called that sucker. I got rid of the chill, but that's not a problem. Okay. Okay, I, I think I got a pattern down now. Possibly. No, oh, my soul beam. Don't care. Keep whirlwinding. We, don't, we only have level one right now access, but that's okay. Because the ignite is all we need. Good job, Northern. Alright, I feel like we've definitely taken a hit as far as effectiveness, but then again, I think the typing is wrong here. That's a big part of it. If I'd taken a different group, we would have done a lot better. And that's just true no matter what. Gemstone Rain, please. Launch them. 
Oh, you know what? Do it again. Why do it again? Because we can build that combo meter. Send it into claws. Get that kill. All right. Beautiful work. Interestingly enough, have not been attacked yet. Or well, we have, but I mean, we haven't lost any regular HP. Okay, keep going. Gemstone, gemstone. I think we got the perfect strat. Uh, you know what? Gotta ignite. Nice. Beautiful. You gonna restore or are you gonna heal? Heal? Okay. Heal means he still has the ignite, which was probably his undoing. Let's go with Jewel Blast this time. Hey, got a couple of grits. That's kind of what I was looking for. I like the idea of Whirlwind. I really do. Claws. Crit. Oh, -ho! good job, Northern. That was such a terrible battle. <laughs> Ugh. Yeah, one was kind of gross. We, we, we won't do that again, but we did get a level up for Vector. Let's give him some more crit chance. It's up to 63... Oh, no, wait, that's crit damage. 20% crit chance. <laughs> I'm dying. Wow. This is the perfect video so far, isn't it? I am so sorry. Uh, no. Yeah. Yeah, 15% on the first hit of each different type of attack. We can use that. Yeah, this, fight, this whole recording is going perfect, isn't it, Vector? You know, with the dying and the dog and everything. He's just excited. You know how it is. Something's outside. Probably just someone walking by. But he has to speak his mind. You know how it is. You know those people who always have to speak their mind and interject themselves into every conversation. Okay, we got a Megator here. Do I want to fight it right now? I mean, I was actually going to say kind of. Okay, now let's actually choose who we're going to use. So, we could use water. We have none. Frick. We need fire. So, Mr. Karate. We need wind. So, vector. And then we need whatever. So, I think we go with Australium. For more wind. Okay, so we're going to start with power. Look at him buffs. Whirlwind. Couple of really good uh, crits there. Flame Strike will actually get the kill in the back. Making it the perfect maneuver. Now we're doing a little bit better. Now we're actually paying attention to what we're doing. What are you going to do? Tackle? Heavy Punch. I forgot you had that. Ain't no thing, though. Don't you worry. Give me a sidekick. Getting stronger. Whirlwind right here. Wham, wham, wham. Oh, so close. But a flame strike will should do it. See what happens when you think about what you're doing for five seconds of your life? Mini tour egg. I already have a mini tour. Does the mini tour evolve into the mega tour? Because that's what this is. Huh. I didn't know that was going to be a mechanic in this game. Hmm. Yo, there you go. Hello, how's it going? You found some rawhide, and now you want me to make warm underwear for you, yes? All right, just a moment. We've done it. All right, I hope you like it. I made it specially for you. We have warm underwear, boys. Stay as long as you like, or you can go test out your warm underwear by diving into some icy water. Just don't forget to visit me every now and then, all right? All right. Cool. I won't be doing that. I died. Anyway, let's go. There's actually a couple of sources of water that we know of. And I want to visit them all. Man, I don't really want to fight you right now. I mean, it's not like we can't use the experience. I just feel like... Eerf, there's other things we want to do, you know? Ah, right, there we go. Cool, an orb three. 130 magic power. Holy crap. Ah, I don't want to give up your crit chance. So who else has good magic? I mean, yeah. 
upgrade to Orb 3. Now, let's see what Australia can do in battle. Oh, wait, did I, did I look at this already? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I went too far. Okay. Wait. Did I make it? I did not make it. Okay. Yo, I'll take this carrot. I will take Claws 3. Hell yeah. Dwayne, he already has Claws 3. Vector, he's Morningstar 2. Replace it with Claws 3. Baby. All right, what's the fastest way to get back? Are you joking me? Right now? Will that send me back? Nope. That was a little awkward, not gonna lie. Okay, that's fine. We did it. That's what's important. We the champs. Made it through another puzzle. Smartest lads in the universe. Right. Rock. That's not how you throw down a rock. That's how you throw down a rock. Okay. By the way, what do you do? Activate Earth Orbs! And you also Earth Orbs! Okay, come on, Australium. I need you. Not in that direction, though. Uh, yes. We gotta go all the way over. Alright. Dang it. Here we go. Okay. I don't remember where the earth orb thing that I had to open was, but let's just go over this way. Uh, you know what, Vector? Do me a favor. Fly! You beautiful creature. Okay. Oh, God! Dang it. No. You can do this! I Yes! I knew I could believe in you. Alrighty. Heading downtown. I think this is another treasure chest, right? No, 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 no. It's, uh, it's this. Ho, 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 ho. <gasps> oh, crap. That's not what I was expecting. That is a koi fish. I think. Is that, am I right on that? The, uh, let me know in the comments section below. That's going to be it for this episode of That Plays Monster Sanctuary. Dude. If you enjoyed it. Make sure to let me know by giving a like if you haven't already. Feel free to subscribe for more. I'm going to keep coming and won't stop coming and not until I've stopped it. Yeah. Thanks again for watching this episode of That Plays Monster Sanctuary. My name is Thet, and I will see you in the next video.